Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition where I'm not really sure what to do at this point. Um, <laughs> just that uh, I want to do like side missions and I think we got to the refugee area. Presidium Commons. Yes, we were there. We should. We should be good. I just want to make sure... I hit up most of the people who now have, like, dialogue, I guess. Mm. Also, freaking, he's, like, calling it my war summit in some places. No, they've got us on rotation. We're mostly in fortified holding zones until strike teams clear an area. Then we come in and set up medical bunkers and supply depots. And then the main fleet comes in to occupy. I'm not wearing commando leather, honey. What does that mean? We'll be perfectly safe. They don't put engineers on the front lines. But you won't be able to talk to us. Me. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I really like the ambient dialogue we've got in this one. It just really hits it all home. Of course I do. Of course I have new messages. Armor. Wait, what, why isn't it? Okay. You just got a shipment of armor delivered to the Normandies from a group of Alliance soldiers who used to be stationed at Rhode Island. Don't know how they found us. They left a note that says you'll need this more than Reckoner Night. Did I freaking buy it? Did I freak it? I have to look at. Oh my gosh. If I spent money on it and I was just going to get. Freaking, I just talked about this. <laughs> I just talked about the Reckoner Knight armor in the last, in the last, uh, episode. And I was like, maybe that's the one I just bought. Um. Oh my gosh, it is. Right? I spent 40k on that. And they sent it to me as a gift? <laughs> I mean, because they, he totally would not have just said, like, like it would have just appeared in my stuff because I bought it. They couldn't, it couldn't, you, you, you. Unless because I bought it, okay, maybe it's like triggering an old DLC thing. Like if you get the DLC, you like get the armor for free. Um, but now because that DLC, I don't know. I don't know. Because I bought it, maybe it triggered that. Oh my gosh. If somebody wants to tell me in the comments, I can't go back and change it because I don't have time. But I am so tempted to go back in time. I bought it like pretty early, early on in my, I'd have to redo the Kasumi thing. Uh it is sick though. I'm definitely gonna wear it. Again, is it is it selected? Yeah, we have a shield boost, weapon damage, melee damage. I'm totally wearing that armor. It's sick. But if I paid for it and it was just supposed to get to me for free, I'm gonna be so angry. I'm gonna be so angry. There's something that's supposed to go there. And we did get the Citadel. Oh, and I, I do like that. It does rotate. It's very cool. Space Hamster, you gotta help me with my financials. I gotta... Where, are the, where do you buy the jellyfish? I swear it's on the Citadel. You can buy jellyfish. And that's all I put in there. Because if you... I, I, I actually really would love to own a jellyfish, like jellyfish tank in real life someday. Um, and you're not supposed to put anything else in there with the jellyfish. Commander. Um... You're supposed to get like a circular tank, also like kind of like a maybe like a spherical or circular tank, and the filtration or the it has to have a constant um, like a cycling of water essentially. So like the because um, if you get like a square tank, the jellyfish they just move not even by like like locomotion they just move by like ocean current. You know they move by current. So you have to like create a round current so that the jellyfish go around and around and around because if you just have a square one it pushes the jellyfish up against like the current essentially that you have from like because especially if you have salt water tanks they have to have a constant like 
rotation of water and I can't think of the word for this it's not filtration but like where you have like the water pump that moves the water around it usually would just kind of move it in like you know in one direction obviously and it'll if you have a square tank it moves the water up against one side of the tank essentially and you know normally the water like just kind of dissipates on its own but a jellyfish will get stuck there and it'll die eventually it doesn't get like squished but like it can't it can't function properly um, and it will die there. So you have to get a round tank and then they go around and around. Like you go to an aquarium, you'll see it. They're in round tanks and they'll go around and around and around. Um, and that's it. And then you, you put the food in there, like the little shrimp giblets in there or whatever, and they just kind of tentacle onto it and they eat it. But you're not even supposed to put any decorations in there or anything because they could get caught on them and they could get stuck and bits of them could get ripped off and they could, you know, die. Um, so yeah. Anyway, which is why that tank that I have in there is not actually a good one for, um, oh, I didn't go to purgatory. We'll do that later. Um, but that's why the tank I technically have in my quarters isn't actually good for jellyfish, but, um, <laughs> I'd do it anyway. Where do I, oh, they don't have the, they only have, like, the main quests. How do I get out of here? Um, they only have the main quests highlighted. Who do we want them to do? We'll go in order. I have the oldest at the bottom. I've sorted it. So we need to go to the Shrike Abyssal. And the Grissom Academy. We need to get that done soon too, but we'll try to do the Shrike Abyssal one. I wish they would, like, have it pop up, what their names are. Like, without me having to hover over it. Also, some systems aren't even open to me yet. Like, there's usually, like, a whole bunch over here. And we don't have the one, there's, like, one that's close to the, to the rim, essentially, of the black hole. See? Oh, hang on. Where did it, there's more frontier. I feel like, yeah, sometimes you can find ones that aren't there uh, yet that you don't have access to if you hover around. I forgot about that. The Shrike Abyssal, let's go. I'm not sure if this is one where like, I have to land on a planet or just scan around and hope I don't get caught. It's probably a scan around and hope I don't get caught. Yes, here we go. So this is one of those older evidences of reapers. Similar craters to those on Aphros created a dust shroud that killed 99% of biota on the planet. The even spacing of the craters indicates coordinated simultaneous attack from points around the globe rather than an asteroid collision or super volcanic scenario. It was home to abundant invertebrate sea life, um, which does, which means I don't think the reapers shouldn't have attacked it if there wasn't like a sentient species on there, unless we just don't have evidence of it. Oh, here we go. Fossil evidence shows this is the golden twin, the golden heavenly twin. Um, so two, what was it? Uh, two worlds of sufficient mass to retain a nitrogen oxygen atmosphere within the habitable life zone. Fossil evidence shows abundant vertebrates and evidence of a sapient terrestrial avian species in its Bronze Age. But the only trace of contemporary life on planet is a single cell organism in the sea. All also suffered from an extinction event, a series of massive impacts that vaporized vast quantities of water and locked dust into the atmosphere. Early theories that this event was collision with fragmenting asteroid have now been discounted. The impact craters were aimed directly at habitation centers. Which, it's interesting, if they were in the Bronze Age, then they weren't technologically advanced. Because they let, they let humanity live. Humanity was like in its, um, like the Neanderthal stage, essentially. Early, early Homo sapien Neanderthal 50,000 years ago, you know? Okay, I think I hit all the planets, so... I found 
found something. Okay. <laughs> eee! Oh, fuel. That's cool. I don't need it. If I do it one more time, they will find me. Oh my gosh, I forgot they brought this back. It's so much slower. Why is it so slow? If it's just money, I swear to goodness. Oh my gosh, it is. Okay, one more time for sure and they will get me. Oh, 100% assets recovered. Thank you, game. So it's gotta be over here. All oh, right, right. This is one of those rare ammonia planets, so the Volos were like, sweet. Yeah. The Reapers are, yeah. The Volos have only, they only really have the, the Turians to defend them. So, they're a client race. So they, they don't have a lot of Signal confirmed. Self defense measures for themselves. What a cool looking planet, though. What'd I get? Brother and Obelisk, sweet. There is apparently more in the system. Wah! Wah! Hang on, hang on. Oh, no, it's right there. No. Oh, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's scary. The wall noise is so loud. Hang on, if I go... No, if I go back in, they'll try to get me again. I don't know. It was probably fuel or something. I don't really care that much. Shoot, I'm going through fuel so fast in this one. My goodness gracious. Goodness me. So some of these are very fetch questy. Why are you glowing? The Cerberus lab. Okay, I did actually want to go there. Hopefully there's a fuel center on this one. There isn't! The Cerberus lab. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it. <laughs> oh no. Let's see if I can't find some fuel. I found something. Oh, oh no, okay. Watson is a garden world claimed by the Chinese People's Federation, United North American States, and the European Union. The Systems Alliance brokered the infamous Reykjavik Compromise, allowing limited colonization from each coalition and cities compromised with populations from each nation. Uh, cool. So this made that at least two more generations of xenozoologists will need, be needed to cl properly classify all the species on the planet. That's cool. Except now all that's on hold. Javelin missile launch. I just found javelin missile launchers. NBD, NBD. Franklin, Watson. These are all very. Well, I guess to be fair, Watson is a British. Like Sherlock and Watsons, and then you have Franklin, the American guy. Wallace. Oh, um. Oh my gosh, the writer, the American writer. Oh, 
calling. I recognize that name, but I can't remember why. Don't recognize this name. Name for the 21st century pioneer of groundwater remediation techniques. Nice. Darwin, classic. So the thing about the scanning thing is you gotta kinda try to you gotta try to scan where you're gonna hit the most number of things. I'm hoping that I actually only recovered 50 percent I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it all the way over there maybe I can coast in well I might not be able to make it back <laughs> signal confirmed fuel please yes I think we get to land on this one. Yes. Go beat up some Cerberus nerds. Where are all my friends? I need to go find Tally, but it feels like I don't want to like start that mission too soon, you know. I don't know. I also don't think I have access. I don't. I just don't have access to her right now. Um. The aura is very powerful. Oh, can we? Oh my gosh, we do have different appearances for them. Oh, Edie can wear clothes. Good for Edie. Oh, wow, he's got... Oh, we've got, like, multiple... He's got a Terminus armor? Oh, my gosh. Let's put him in the Terminus armor. It looks really sick. Do we have... Oh! Maybe I don't have to get a mod for Edie. Although, I don't think she'll be wearing it in the... I think her... Yeah, her, her face thing changed, too. That's cool. I like this one. How many do we have for Liara? That one's very cool. Okay, I really like that last one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All of these are like weird for him. Let's bring, let's bring Edie and see what she can do. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> She's got a giant boob window. Of course she does. <laughs> oh my gosh. Poor Edie. Let's see. Oh yeah, the sniper. It does less damage, but has a slower fire rate too, by a little bit. We'll go fine. Helps aim through smoke, love that. Interesting. For my companions, I generally don't do like concentration or like um, accuracy ones because I feel like they don't like they're they're already bots, you know. <laughs> so, ooh, increased weight capacity. Yes, I might go with that. Let's do that. Shoot. Okay, let me grab. Let me grab Edie's stuff really quick. 
I realize taking her and Garrus out kind of like overloads the tech side of things, but I'm not, I'm not super worried about it. I do remember thinking the decoy was pretty cool. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I like it. Okay. Onwards. Commander, I've got a hail from Admiral Hackett. Oh boy. Put him through, Lieutenant. Shepard, we've uncovered a secret server's lab. Function yeah, unknown. I know. We sent in a recon team, but they were forced to pull out before they got very far. Any other intel? We think they're using the facility to warehouse and study Reaper tech. Oh, we God. We're wondering how service is connected to the Reapers, and this might give us some answers. We're on it. Find out what Cerberus is doing and get me any Reaper tech samples you can, Commander. Hack it out. I don't think we should touch any of that with the ten foot pole. My armor is sick. <laughs> I do worry some of the mods or like the mod like two of the mods I was looking at might not have all the um body mesh mods, like body mesh um muscle expansion I guess for all the armors especially some of these like specialty ones that I think were you know very rare thanks I definitely way. know there's there's stuff oh these are like grenades there's there's uh there's some sort of upgrade I can get in here I remember you're just gonna chill here that's cool that's cool Do I have the right gun? I do. Everybody else has the right gun? Excellent. Whee! Let's use the decoy. Oh, time to go. Oh, I just... Okay, I was like, did I reload? I did. Danger, danger, danger. I gotta be careful. Come on, stand up. No. Okay, I guess you won't. Then I will come to you this way. Dang it. Oh, shoot! What are you doing back there? Dang. Nice combo. Combo, wombo combo. Oh, are you an enemy? <laughs> you were. It was walking so close to me that I thought. Um, I thought um, it was a, it was a companion. <laughs> I was like, mm, yes, my companion is walking with me. It's like, nope, that was a guy trying to shoot me in the back. This armor looks really cool. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I forget, we have photo mode. Look at it. If I if I spent money on it and I didn't have to, though, I would be very upset. Uh, let's see. We look really cool. Look at us. Oh, my gosh, we look cool. I'm, I'm a sucker for photo mode. And also, this armor is just sick. I love the like plate mail like armor. It's so fun. It's like it's such an impractical idea, but like could you imagine in the future like if you could make armor like this this is like a specialty armor for like um like the games thing that we were seeing, right? But they've like they tried to incorporate like um how do I get out of here? Um like modern technology and making like ancient armor like ancient so that looks like ancient armor viable. Um, but it's more of a show piece, I think, than anything. More of a game piece, I guess, than, uh, than a firefight one. But it looks cool, so. What am I doing? Your signature is definitely Reaper technology. Oh, this. I need to pick up this. Hang on, there's other things I need to look at. I think. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, was it like a timed thing? I swear there's something else to pick up. Maybe it's when I get in there eventually. 
Look at that. Blah. That's the... I think that's very similar to the Reaper. Oh, I can't just pick that one up. Oh. I'm just... Oh, that's right. I have to drop them off individually. I can't pick them up one... Or, like, you know, all three or whatever at a time. More credits. Nice. Thank you. I'm feeling a little better about wasting my credits on this armor. To be fair, Shepard doesn't have pockets. What do you mean I can see it with my eyeballs? There's like three of them in there. I see you. Oh, and it's got armor too. Cool, 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 cool. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I just blew them up. Oh, there you are. Nope, nope. Oh, the engineer. Oh yeah, that's why I, there was like the turrets and stuff. Is there engineer? Nope, that didn't work. Yeah, listen here, you. You're not gonna have a good time. Oh, I have to reload. Hang on. <laughs> Hello? Hello? I heard. I think I heard somebody. No? Give it to me! Must be Reaper. My brand. Oh, I need to use, like, the decoy and stuff. I'm distracted. I'm using all my own abilities. Oh no. Steve. We just need to hold out until Cortez can pick us up. Nothing like being stranded. Never said it would be easy. Nothing is ever easy. It's the decoy. Yeah. Oh, there is an achievement. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's an achievement, and I did check this, and they still have it. Um, for shooting these guys through the eye slits. Hang on. He, he's, like, wiggling. Okay. Fire has increased with the upgrades. Look at them rolling. I will go back. The shotgun, though. Where are they? Behind me? Behind me? There was. Somebody on the map here. I'm like right on top of them. Are they in the wall? Or are they following me? <laughs> They're like, it's really funny. They're like right behind me. I'm like, eh. I'm just going around in circles. Where is everybody? I need the challenge all enemies button. I just. Is there somebody chasing me? <laughs> Hello. Get ready for a bad day. This is my favorite combo in Andromeda. Oh, 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 hang on, hang on. I don't think his face isn't in there, though. Where? That man is headless. I swear, I swear he's headless. Maybe not. But his face. No, he was! No, he wasn't. I don't know. <laughs> ah! Ow, 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 ow. Calm down, calm down.
Their abilities are so slow. Lieutenant. Oh, I do need to use ice so I can combo with Garrus better. Find another way. Keep fighting. Get out. Oh, I do need to use hail. Where I was like, where are you? I know you're in there somewhere. Actually, if we're gonna be having these guys, I should probably equip Garrus on the sniper rifle. Cause he's got he's got sights that can see through smokes. How do I change? Hey, okay, okay, okay. Now let's give him And I go. Ow, ow. No, no. Hey, a journal entry. <laughs> Finally here. Wow, the troops are really intense. No one smiles ever. And suicide on capture orders? Seriously, they call training integration. I start being integrated tomorrow. Can't wait. Yep, yep. That's a. Uh... Freaking Cerberus kid was probably just like some Nazi who was like super excited to be racist and doesn't realize that like being involved in that's just like a bad time. Hang on, I want to punch you. Did it, did it work? I did not. I did not. I didn't aim properly. Punches are hard to aim. I want to use. Yeah. Cortez, buddy. Oh, he's. He's fine. Oh, oh no. Oh wait, I should use a... Uh... Yikes! And... Boom! Is there somebody still behind us? Get over, get over here with your stupid shields. Take that. I really enjoy this. Oh wait, are you dead? Oh no. Oh no. Did I oh, it didn't let me do it. I clipped it. Dang it. <sighs> Don't make me redo this. I'll scream. the edge. Ah, oh jeez. I feel like they should say something. I feel like my shotgun just kills them very quickly. You know? I don't really have the chance to cryo-freeze them and have Garrus concussive shot them. Also, I just like using my face a lot. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, dang it. I can't knock him off. Yeah. I can now? Yes. Turret. Oh, jeez. Oh no, it's gonna it's gonna hurt. I need to get my barriers back so I have to charge. We good? Oh hey, we need to stop setting up turrets. I only get to. I only need to get two. I saw other Reaper artifacts. 
I'm just gonna leave the rest of them in there? Commander, I swear I got to pick up something else to too. Protect you secured from that lab. What was Cerberus doing with it? We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. Okay, so I get to keep going. Maybe when another one of the things that I can pick up shows up. Money! I love money. Alien. Oh yeah, I remember. This is just... I don't know if... This might be like the non-council species. Spectre unit. Yeah, buddy. He's the group spokesperson. Hanar and Drell for... Oh, okay. The Hanar have also provided the services of their best Drell combat specialists. While the Hanar are normally loath to send trusted allies into open warfare, there's a desperate times. I don't think you should be able to send another species out. You know what I mean? They should. The species should decide that they want to go. It's just we. It's weird. Their whole relationship's weird. I don't like it. The fifth fleet update: A pair of entrepreneurs was persuaded to switch from creating financial programs to advanced part target weapon targeting VI and sell them above the alliance just above cost. See, so we're getting we're getting there. We're we're getting things updated. Kasumi, yes, yes, yes. No one asks how she acquires the items. Good, good, good. Crucible. Oh, okay. The javelin missiles release dark energy. Even the strongest kinetic barriers. But it's not part of the crucible. That's just part of like the fleet stuff. X Cerberus. As the elusive man's methods become more extreme, skilled operatives abandon Cerberus. Okay. Data liberated from a Cerberus research lab includes reports on the composition and strengths of various Reaper units. Interesting. Okay. That's all the data we got. I think I will call this episode here. But we're getting there. That was that was two that was two little missions all in a row. Eee. Um so I still have the Prothean obelisk, but I will probably honestly go to Grissom here soon. Some of these are stuff you can just you just gotta pick up as you go. Um, the biotic amp interfaces, for example, are at Grissom Academy, so I'll be able to pick them up there and drop them off. So I try to get as many as I can, and then I and I come drop them off at the various places. But anyway, thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Reese Carito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special shout out to Christopher, my tree tier patron. Thank you so, so much for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I just appreciate it a lot. I hope you're enjoying the series. <laughs> but yeah, thank you all so much for watching. And I hope to see you in the next one.